Shut F7. YouTube, 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 what's up? It's your boy Jarvis once again back with another video. And as you can see, I'm in my football room. So guess what? This is a football video, man. You already know. So I had a little visit over the weekend. I took a trip down to Greenville. Saw my guys at Green Gridiron Sports, man. They hooked me up with the new 2020 Shut F7. Now this is the satin black, as you can see. The satin black is, is totally different from the matte black. I'll do a comparison to my other helmet, but you can see this is the Shut F7 in satin black, man. Bam, bam, bam. All right, first of all, the first looks of the helmet, the looks of the helmet is crazy, man. As you can see, this, this thing is crazy, man. This, it looks good, looks great. Um, I really like the satin. The satin looks completely different from the flat black or the matte black as you will say this is all the all black version so you can see it this is a size large i have a large head yeah so yeah man these are some things that i like about the helmet overall the first thing i like about it is the overall look man the overall look looks mean it looks crazy it looks it looks safe to be honest yeah i like these whatever these panels up here whatever they're called i don't know what they're called but i like how that looks um I seen some guys like you see how this is like gray or silver you guys can see i see some guys get this their team color so my team colors is black and purple so if i really wanted to i could switch this out and have this show purple and it's pretty cool i don't know where to get that up but i see some guys have it some guys in the league nfl they have that as well um, another thing i like about it it's comfortable man i mean compared to the speed flex eh, i mean comfort level is there but I want to say this might be a little bit more comfortable because it has this nice padding inside. It's nice, you know. Check it out for yourself. Believe me or not, I don't care. But hey, I'm just doing my honest review on it. Um, another thing that I like about it it's the F7. Everyone wants this helmet. Everyone wants it. So, yeah. Now to the negative. The one thing I don't like about this helmet is. You'll see it in a second. <sighs> I think it's too big, man. Like, it looks too big on my head. I don't know if it's just me. Let me know down in the comments if y'all think this helmet is too big or, I mean, I wear a large. This thing looks like an extra large. I mean, the face mask is pretty cool. I mean, this is the EGOP2. I usually rock the EGOP1. It's just a one bar. And then not this middle bar in the middle, but just these two bars. And it'll be widening out a little bit more because I play wide receiver quarterback. So, yeah, this is not my typical face mask. But, yeah, man, let me know down in the comments if it's too big, man. But, honestly, this is my only negative about this helmet. It's a personal problem. I don't know. But, yeah, let me know down in the comments. If you guys rock with this helmet or not, man. And I got something special coming soon. Soon, soon, soon. Man, but let you know, if you guys like this review, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more videos, man. Thank you.